Hello, everyone. I'm Julian Jacquez, and I'm here with Heather Martyr from the Real of Las Vegas. Hi. What have you been up to since your season has aired? Well, my season aired, what was it, March to June, and then uh, I went straight back to school up north at Mount University. Um, I finished my degree uh, in August, so I finished it up in the summer. I finished, uh, I was a TV production major and an IT minor, so I've just been kind of, you know, looking for work like everyone else that just got out of school, and um, I've been doing a few things on the side, uh, some things that I can talk about, some things that I can't, but um, my one thing that I'm actually really excited about that I started recently, um, unfortunately, my um, my mom's aunt passed away, and she left behind kind of like all of this vintage jewelry and stuff, and, and I didn't want it to kind of or I didn't want to kind of just get rid of it. Like, I, you know, my mom wanted to kind of, she didn't know what to do with it, and it became, you know, this kind of whatever. So I, I decided to um, start making jewelry out of it. So I think I'm going to maybe possibly start a jewelry line. Um, but first I'm just going to kind of sell some items on eBay that I make, and I'm, I'm you know, mixing the vintage with kind of like new stuff that I think is, is cool. So um, I'm kind of excited about that. And, you know, that's, Basically, it. my show was not too long ago, so. Are you still very close with Nani and Naomi? Yeah, I'm still very close with Nani and Naomi. I, um, we try, I think, to to catch up as as much as possible, but Nani's all the way in Arizona, and um, Naomi's always busy doing in a shoot or something. So it's kind of hard to to keep in touch all the time, but we definitely try to keep in touch a lot. And Naomi's birthday is actually um, in January 22nd, so we're all meeting up in New York City, so that should be really fun. Are you and Dustin still together? Mm-hmm. Yeah, me and Dustin um, are together. Uh, and I think people will hear more about our relationship soon, but uh, we're really happy together, and we are together. So. <laughs> Do you guys plan on getting married? Ah. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Which roommates do you still talk to every day? I mean, I still talk to all of them. Um, obviously, some more than others. I keep in touch with the girls a lot, and obviously, I talk to Dustin all the time. But um, as for the other roommates, like we, you know, we chat, we keep each other updated on like really important events. Like I'll still think of everyone in that house as like a part of my family, essentially, because you know we did go through such a intense experience together. But um, yeah, so I try to I try to keep in touch with everyone. Now, are you still living with your parents, or are you and Dustin like living together? Um, me and Dustin are working on getting an apartment um in the Philadelphia area, as we speak. What did you think of this season of the Real World, which was uh, the Real World San Diego? San Diego. Mm-hmm. Um, I thought I I really liked the cast. I think um. There's a lot of cool people in it that, you know, I would love to hang out with. Um, I can't say I meet, I got to see every single episode, um, but I thought that, you know, they obviously had a good season as as they brought light on a lot of issues, you know, which is always good. I mean, I, I didn't really get to see a lot of the season. I've been kind of busy uh, doing a lot of things, but I really like the people that they chose, they chose for it. Have you met anyone from the season? Um... I have met some of them. Um, I think that I have talked to uh, Priscilla and Alex, and I think that they're really sweet. And I've talked to um, Ashley a little bit, and she seems sweet. All the girls, they all seem very relatable. Like, they all seem, like, really cool, chill people. So mm-hmm. I, think it was, I think it was good. I mean, I don't really know how the season kind of went out because I missed a lot of it, but I like the people in it. <laughs> now, would you ever do a challenge? Um... You know, I if the situation comes about where um, I always said, you know, if I finished school and if I didn't have a job and I had, you know, a time where I could make that commitment, then I would definitely do it for the experience. So, yes, probably. Okay. So should we expect to see you on our TV soon? Or like, is there any good <laughs> new projects that we could possibly look forward to? Um, I'm always – thinking up things and, we'll, you know, I'm still out there trying to find a job and, you know, do, trying to find things that I really enjoy doing and that take up my time that I think are worthwhile. So, um, yeah, maybe, possibly. Um, but, yeah, right now I'm mainly, you know, working on that jewelry. I'm working on kind of finding a job and and kind of 
getting back into my regular life. All right, so that's all I have, actually. So thanks for listening, everyone. Yes, thanks for having me. All right, nice talking to you. Nice talking to you, too.